Hey, single cancers, who's coming in for you? Single cancers, divine spirit, Holy Spirit. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Whoa, okay. We have a Gemini coming through. Who's coming in for single cancers? Single cancers, who's coming in? We have Scorpio energy coming through. And we also have Pisces coming through. So strong water sign for some of you. Also an air sign. We do have Capricorn at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Coming through. I feel like this is a very emotional person. I'm getting rising signs out of this. So they could be a Gemini rising, Scorpio rising, or Pisces rising. I just heard Pisces moon sign. This could be your energy as well. Take it as it resonates. But I'm feeling someone who is very emotional, especially if they're a, a water sign rising. Someone who's very, very emotional. Um, and when I say that, I'm not saying someone who walks around crying every two seconds. That's not what I mean. I mean someone who... I should say sensitive, someone who knows how to tap into that side of themselves and someone who's not afraid to tap into that side. This could be someone who's very intuitive. When you get any type of water sign energy, this is someone who is extremely spiritual, intuitive. They may even see spirits or be into the occult in some type of way. This is uh this is the energy of Gemini, a talker, a very analytical person, but also a person who is in touch with their emotions at the same time. Very creative person as well. They may do some type of creative writing um or speaking. Who is this person coming in for single cancers? This person coming in for single cancers. Who is this person? Show a spirit who this person is. <clears throat> Piscean energy coming through strong <clears throat> with the energy of the high priestess. Very spiritual. Again, a very spiritual person. They could be very into church or into their religion. They could be a, a very devout religious person as well. <clears throat> Who is this person <clears throat> coming in for single cancers? We have Libra's energy here and one other one flipped out. Ace of Swords. <clears throat> I'm also getting someone who works with law. This is someone who cannot handle a liar. I don't know why I'm getting that, but you guys, I'm feeling that very, very strongly. Justice with the Ace of Swords, with the High Priestess. This is someone who does not like secrets. Or if you try to keep secrets from this person, they would find out very quickly. Because they are very intuitive and they are very smart. Okay, with the energy of Gemini and Libra, this person, they know how to get the truth out of you. I, I just I want to say it. Okay, Ace of Wands is here with the Ace of Swords. It's like this person can see right through you um, in a good way. I don't mean like they're trying to find out something bad about you. No, it's like they can see into you. You know that that intimacy so into me, you see, or something like that. So, uh, you know, that saying that came out, <laughs> that's what I'm getting. Like a very, uh, strong connection with you and this person intimately. And I feel like this person just sees into your soul. They may like your eyes. <clears throat> Two of wands is here. What is the question here for this person coming into single cancer's life? What is that? Two of wands. What is the question here? Nine of Swords, okay. Page of Cups. <laughs> so they could be a little bit afraid of <clears throat> your answer. Um, if this person asks you out or if they, you know, want to talk to you in some type of way, they could be afraid of how you would respond. Whoa, could be an Earth sign. Earth sign just came through. I also feel like with this Queen of Pentacles, this person deeply uh, respects you or admires you. Eight of Wands. Wow. Something is, y'all, something is coming in. This could be a person who would need to travel to see you as well. Who is this person coming in for single cancers? Whoa, something shout out. Hold on. I'm like, where did it go? It went underneath my chair. Hold on. 
What is this? Okay, the Three of Cups. <laughs> three of Cups. This could be someone coming back into your life. They could be an earth sign coming in, reconciling with you. Okay. Yeah, show me that energy. Ooh, strong Taurus. Could be a Taurus for some of you. I also feel like someone, maybe things didn't work out before. But someone's coming in to reconcile. This doesn't have to be an ex, you guys. I'm feeling someone who is very serious about a commitment. Possibly wanting marriage with the Empress and the Har font here. This is someone who is very stable, loyal. Show me this person. Wow, someone who could be a little bit younger than you. For some of you. We have the Page of Wands, the Knight of Swords. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling like you may have talked to this person already. They could know you already. And I'm feeling like uh, the two of you, maybe you had a flirtation, but it never really got anywhere. Or you may have gone somewhere with this person once or twice. Magician in reverse. Yeah. Something did not manifest. See, the sirens are going off here, you guys. It's also raining if you hear the rain. I love rain. Um, But... It's like, yeah, that's like confirmation. Something did not manifest. Why didn't it manifest? What happened here? Why didn't it manifest? Why did this not manifest? Two of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Temperance. Okay, so someone could have waited. They may have been giving to another situation or... uh I'm getting the energy of someone who was already in a relationship. Maybe it was just bad timing with temperance. Like this person had to wait. They had to wait. Yeah. Anything else cancers would need to know about this person coming in for single cancers. King of Wands is in reverse. Oh, yeah. So they're not a player. This is not a player. If, if you're... Coming to this reading thinking about someone who did you wrong and all of that. It's, it's not... This is not that person. Nope. <laughs> this is not a player. Uh-uh. Whoa. Okay, all the cards want to flip out. Show me that King of Wands in reverse for single cancers. Well, the Page of Pentacles. Five of Cups. And the Moon. Yeah, see, when they talk to you, they may uh, be afraid as well. They may have a bit of fear of the past repeating itself, they could have dealt uh, with a fire sign. They could have dealt with a player energy. They could have been uh, giving to a Sagittarius that played them or that did them wrong. And this person could be afraid of that. Afraid of something repeating itself. I think I got this uh, energy for single cancers before. Like you may have a lot in common with this person. <clears throat> Okay, so what deck? Okay, what initials are coming through? Who's coming in for single cancers? This could be a person, place, or thing, but I'm asking for the initials of the person coming in, okay? Just want to be very clear about that because we have some questions about the letters, okay? <clears throat> Should be self-explanatory, right? <laughs> okay, the letter F coming through, the letter U coming through. The letter J is coming through. The letter B. Who's coming in for single cancers? The letter I. Let's get two more. The letter C. And the letter H coming through for single cancers. When can cancer expect this person? The month of August is coming through. Could be Leo. Leo season. Monday. Could be significant. And let's get one more. Okay, we got two more. June could be significant in Gemini season and Tuesday. Okay, what's the advice for single cancers? Advice for single cancers in this situation. What is the advice? Perfect timing. See, didn't I say cancers, something was not the right time. And you may have had to back off this person because maybe they already had a boyfriend or girlfriend or a wife or a husband. 
something was not the right timing. I feel like this person was giving to another situation, possibly when you encountered this person and this held things up. But this person, it's like they're dropping that other person. They could be letting go of a fire sign. I'm feeling very strongly they're letting go of someone and now they're feeling like it's perfect timing. I also feel like this person is hoping that they didn't miss out on this opportunity with you when they come to talk to you. Okay, Page of Pentacles. Yeah, perfect timing. This person coming in, the situation will improve is at the bottom of the deck. Alrighty, single cancers, that is your energy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monetero. I look forward to hearing from you. Take care. Bye.